I need that money. I really, really do. I need that money. I, I really need that money. Really need that money. I need that money. I really, really do. I need that money. I, I really need that money. Really need that money. Really that money. That money. <clears throat> No headbutt. Can't do anything. Mash jab. So now I can ban this person. So now I quit, and now I can actually ban this person. Okay. Good. And no, he's not good. He's fucking doing drive rush throws. I can't. What do you want me to do with 80 millisecond connection? I literally will never break a throw. He'll just get throws endlessly. So, okay. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Now I don't have to deal with this loser. Good. Now, I'm, I wonder if that's the same guy. Probably not. Probably have one or two others like that tonight. And we'll block them and then we can play real people. Hmm. Okay. All right, so I got a dollar tip from a troll. Ignore that. I got a three dollar tip from Dan the Man. Thank you, Dan the Man. That's hilarious. Someone says that yellow card does mean that you're in low priority for the queue. So literally within the thousands upon thousands of matches that I have played in this game, I've disconnected three times all to trolls who are either playing completely unprofessionally like teabagging or having names that were insulting to me and my family and so i black out of those matches and now i'm in the bad priority queue even though i've done it three times in 10 months the game's been out and the thousands upon thousands of matches i played wow capcom knows what they're doing huh capcom really knows what the fuck they're doing right <laughs> that's it's pretty impressively bad and stupid i think capcom should get fucked what a bunch of morons Hey, Capcom, why don't you actually watch a fucking stream to see the kind of shit that the idiotic trolls do on streams of your game before you do a blanket practice that's a fucking stupid and punishes the wrong people? Yeah, well, I'm not going to disconnect because I can't. Now that I know, there's no point to disconnecting because I, if I disconnect, I can't ban the person anyway, right? So I got to at least play one match against the person and then we can disconnect or excuse me, then we can just quit out and then we can block the person. So there's like no point to disconnecting at all. Yeah, I love game devs I'm completely out of touch with reality. Oops. We would actually watch a, like a stream that's not like fucking one of the top player streams to try to figure out how the game actually works. Oh, shit. Well, it takes take some work. <laughs> take some effort. Well, I don't know how long we're going to have to wait to get a match, guys. People are saying if I do, like, two more matches, you'll be out of that queue. But what am I going to do? I, the same thing's going to happen if I go to rank two then, right? It sucks because with rank, you know, again, I know I'm just going to get bodied. I need practice. I'm out of practice with this character. He's a low-tier character, so I need to get back into the swing of things to do anything. I'm not going to throw away my rank points. Ranked and casual with different queues, so then there's no point because it's not even gonna help. It's not even gonna help this queue. So. Yeah, I know the blinking screen is very annoying. I don't know why they did that. Why does the screen blink like this when it's matchmaking? It's really stupid. Jade, no, I don't wanna play arcade. I'm trying to play multiplayer, Jade. It's not going to help to play arcade. 
needs to learn matchup knowledge and stuff. There's nothing I can do. I literally have to sit here. We might have three matches all night, and there's nothing I can do because I can't fix it. Just Capcom are a bunch of fucking idiots. That's great. Ugh. Great. Well, this is a fun night. What do you guys want to talk about? Sorry, I'd love to play the game, but, you know, I didn't make it. What would you guys like to talk about tonight? <laughs> Since it looks like we'll be waiting an hour to get a match. <clears throat> oh, really? Overwatch queues are now 40 minutes? Holy shit. Wow. Yak, there's no point to doing that. The whole point here is for me to get practice and not have people have, be, have an abusable environment where they're just going to come in and say disgusting stuff, you know? I'm not going to make do that. Obviously, they're already out in force. I'm not going to make a fucking lobby and give them a, an outing to do that. I'm not dumb. Uh, well, I don't know how to fix this stuff. Because if I never play the matches, then casual play will always be fucked up. What if you change characters? What if you completely change your character? What if I go to, like, Blanca? Blanca. Right? Because that's a... Well... I mean, it's a different ranking entirely, right? Like, let's try this. Does this fix anything? The thing that's really dumb about that, too, what if you just have a bad internet day? Oh, my internet's kind of screwed up, right? <laughs> oh, well, guess what? You can't play the game because your internet was screwed up on a bad day, right? That's stupidity. It's tied to the ID, not to the character, so this doesn't even matter. All right, there you go. Wow, this is completely stupid. Honda. Hey, Capcom, I'm trying to avoid people with abusive names, abusing your name system, saying awful things about myself, my family members. That's why I'm quitting out. Not because I'm a sore sport, but I guess you're too dumb to understand that people shouldn't have to be bullied and abused in your game because you have poor protections against it, right? pretty sad can you there is a way to hide all names right but that's kind of lame you know i want to see my opponent names it is kind of lame to have to hide all names just in case some fucking dunce puts in a, a stupid name Press start. There we go. Yeah, how would I turn off all names? Not that it matters at this point. I think you could do it in like... Uh, I think I found it at first and we had that set up. I'm pretty sure we had that set up, right? Yeah, see, I can't... It's too fucking stupid. You have to find it in one of these weird menus. And it's just so dumb. I'm going to go through every menu to try to find this, right? Yeah, right. I have no idea. <laughs> it's a battle hub setting, but I'm not in battle hub. Right? If I'm not in battle hub, why would I want to change the battle hub setting? Does it even make sense? This is Battle HUD. No, forget it. Forget it. This is too, too, oh my god. I'll do Worldwide. Connection 3 to 5. <laughs> worldwide. Poops, please shut up. Please stop being obnoxious in the chat. Thank you. Well, I don't know. What do you guys want to talk about? I can't fix this uh, unless what they should do. They should have like a 30-minute time limit on it. Or it should be based off of 
all of your wins and losses together and matches, not based off of, oh, your recent performance. Because what if there's a day when your internet's fucked up and you're trying to play and your internet keeps going on? You're like, I didn't know my internet was messed up today. You get punished for that? No, it should be based on overall. If you've played thousands upon thousands of matches and you've disconnected from three, it should not punish you like this. This is completely stupidity. It's dunce level game development and whoever made this decision should be fired. It's stupid. It doesn't make any fucking sense. There's a difference if someone habitually is quitting out of matches versus someone quit out of three matches out of 7,000. It's moronic. <laughs> it doesn't make any sense at all. <clears throat> the part of me that I didn't want to play the game and be bullied. I played it, right? Like, I actually wanted to enjoy your fighting game and not be bullied by people because you have an open name system, right? Excuse me for not putting myself into an abused environment while playing your video game online. I wasn't aware that was my fault, right? That I made the game like that. Oops. <clears throat> Boom, 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 boom. What's funny is someone just said, why play Street Fighter when you get beat up in Twitter comments, which makes no sense, but it's like, you realize I don't see any Twitter comments, right? My Twitter is is in a situation where I only can see comments from people who like are approved users and no one can respond to me either. Like if they do, I still don't see it. I don't see any of it. I don't have to ever read anyone's dumb comment ever. I don't ever see that. There's entire giant viral negative things about me. I've never seen one of them. I don't bother with it because I'm not a moron. I don't waste time on Twitter. A bunch of idiots being to toxically stupid to myself and others. I just ignore all that shit. So I never get to see it ever. I never see it. So any moron who ever tweets that, I've never seen it once. I only basically, um, I only basically, uh, have, use Twitter for work. Like that's it. That's its use now. I don't really do much up there besides just work stuff. Well, I guess that's it. I can't play. What am I now? How do I fix this? If I can literally never find a custom match, how am I supposed to fix this problem? Are you telling me my custom matches are permanently disabled in this game? What if a new a new character comes out? How am I supposed to practice with them? I'm not allowed to because I quit from three matches in the last week. Are you out of your mind? It's on a timer, what's the timer? How long is the timer? Because what's the point in sitting here when we're not gonna get a match? We'll go do something else, right? And then we'll come back. What is the timer? It didn't show a yellow card before either. It never showed a yellow card, but then when I went to matchmake, it showed a yellow card when it jo was joining a match. <clears throat> So what's hilarious is what you're telling me is that troll actually ha was a quitter. Like, that's why they were under the yellow card system, right? There is no set timer, says Green Mega Man. Why do you guys give me always contradictory information? How do you guys not understand? So literally, I can never play. I will never be able to play a casual match of Street Fighter VI ever again because this will not find a match. Does that make any sense? Dax Fraction says, I heard playing against people in Battle Hub may help remove it. It's not going to help me. The moment I go to Battle Hub, you know the trolls are going to find that Battle Hub and flood it with toxic, disgusting stuff that I can't show on my stream. So I can't ever use Battle Hub. We already know that from the beta, that the Battle Hub is useless. It goes away after a few days of games. No one has a figure. Wow. <laughs> That's great. Well, fuck it. I guess we'll do rank, and then I'm just gonna... My, my Honda rank's gonna be destroyed. There's nothing I can do. I'm not good with Honda right now. I'm very rusty. 
You know what I mean? Like, I know I'm going to lose nonstop a Honda. But I'm not going to sit here and not play the fucking game all night because Capcom doesn't know how to fucking make a game because they're morons. So I'm going to at least play, and I guess I'm just going to lose all my points. What else can I do, right? What else can I fucking do? I've, I've played one match with Honda, and it wasn't a good one. And I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm going to be rusty as shit, and now I'm just going to lose all my points. Great. Great, Capcom. Oh, uh, guess what? It's still not working. And we're in ranked now. So now I can't play the game at all. Well, if that's the case, I want a fucking refund from Capcom. <laughs> I literally can't play ranked either. So you tell me what's going on. I'm just supposed to sit here and do nothing all night. That's cool. That's a cool stream. Thanks, Capcom. Thanks a lot, guys. Wow, you guys are geniuses, huh? Well, you guys want to shoot fighter back, but this may be the end of it. I mean, that's idiocy. Complete fucking idiocy. Yeah, it won't find anybody. Think about that. Blacklisted. This was blacklisted. Blacklisted for quitting three games in a week? Of people who were being abusive to me? That's great. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm expecting a refund for the game then. <laughs> if I can't play it any further. <clears throat> oh, that is true. You can queue for both, right? You're right. I can do both. Not that this is going to help at all. We'll try for both. I totally forgot you could do both at, a t at the same time. No, I don't have 10 PSN accounts. I'm not a fucking idiot who does this on purpose. I do it because I'm getting fucking harassed online. You know, I don't regularly quit because I'm a sore loser idiot who sucks at video games. I did it because people were using offensive names, you know? <clears throat> wow. Well, I think this is going to be a Q&A stream, guys. It sure seems that way, does it not? We'll do all. Here we go. Every every type, worldwide, all connections, cross-play. <laughs> now you can't possibly cast a wider net, right? That's the absolute widest net possible. Right? Oh, 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 what was that? There was almost a match. <laughs> 